What is happening guys, it's your boy TC back with another video. So uh, a lot of news and rumours and reports have been circulating around the internet uh, in terms of Arsenal letting go one of their key players out of the two strikers that we have in the team, uh, either Lacazette or Aubameyang. And uh, basically the reason for me to make this video is to play a little bit of a, a devil's advocate really and see what you guys think in terms of us actually going ahead and selling one of these players. Of course, it won't be the wisest of ideas, won't be the best idea, but um, if this was to happen, will it help us move forward in the transfer market? Will it help in terms of the team development, etc.? That's what I'll be talking about in this particular video. So as mentioned, uh, a lot of rumors and reports that have been surfacing suggesting that either Lacazette or Aubameyang will be sold in this particular summer transfer window. As mentioned at the top of the video, again, it won't be the wisest of ideas, but if we were to sell one of those players. Um, the player I would personally opt to sell will be Aubameyang. Yes, slightly a little bit controversial. However, the reason I suggest that if we were to sell one of those players, we should sell Aubameyang is purely because of Aubameyang's age. Uh, he's pushing 30 and um, essentially it doesn't have many years at the top um, going on the usual footballing trend of how players sort of um, decline once they hit 30 years old, Arsene Wenger had a policy of not renewing contracts of players that are over 30 for more than one year. So if we were to look at that particular policy, did it work? Maybe, maybe not really. At times over the years, we've missed experience where the team was made up of a, a lot of younger players. You do need older players within your team. That's one given. Uh, experience counts. A cool, calm head is always needed. Uh, but if we're going to be looking at this, Aubameyang also does have two years left on his contract. Rahul Sanheli came out recently suggesting that players that have two years left on their contracts will be sold uh, if they don't want to renew with the club. So we get to that point now where Aubameyang has got that particular amount of time left on his contract. Will the club be brave and sell him? Of course, Golden Boot winner last season. Can't deny the fact that he's absolutely phenomenal. Uh, at times um, when we had nothing up top, Aubameyang came up with the goods, as well as the fact that at times when we wanted him really to perform, uh, he went missing. Of course, the Golden Boot achievement was absolutely fantastic. Can't take that away from him, of course. But as mentioned, for me, if I were to sell Yes, I would sell Aubameyang due to the fact that his age is slightly older than Lacazette. Uh, but I do believe Lacazette will be able to, to actually hold up the attack by himself. Who else will come in? Of course, we do have the youngsters such as Edin Katia. Or the manager might go and dip into the transfer market using the funds that would have been generated from that particular transfer off Aubameyang. And reports have been surfacing or suggested that Aubameyang is wanted in China. Real Madrid are interested in his services. I don't know how much the Real Madrid story will go purely because they've signed a striker recently, Njovic, uh, who came from Frankfurt. So I don't think there will be in the market for a striker any further. But Aubameyang is wanted in China, supposedly according to these reports and I do believe if an offer came in of 80 million plus then the club should take that particular offer that money as long as that money is put it back straight into transfers and the manager and his technical directors etc can use that money to actually reinvest into the team then that will be a wise sell in my opinion uh, Aubameyang can go and set sell in the sunset in China get his retirement package, his pension, if you want to call it that, in China, and then he can actually retire in peace. But if we were to sell, as mentioned, I would definitely go for Bamiyang. Um, it would be the wiser option, in my opinion. Uh, of course, we will lose a lot of goals. There'll be plenty of goals lost if we were to sell him, but it's then down to the manager to find an adequate replacement who will be able to get those goals for us. Like Azette, as mentioned, he will be able to do that job for us. Um, of course, he will need a significant amount of help to do so. Not one man will make the team, but I'm in favour of selling one of those two players if it comes down to it as well as the fact that if we do have that reported 45 million pound to spend in the summer uh, selling Aubameyang will certainly make sense um, of course it will be a certainly controversial move 
if the club was to action this particular move but that's what i think in regards to this whole situation um of course you guys please do let me know what you think in the comments below if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed to the channel please do make sure that you do hit that subscribe button so once again guys it's your boy tc from i'm gonna talk tv and i'm out